actually go to NASA mm -hmm. and we do like um, what they do is astronaut training. Okay. So like all the. And what does that involve? There's one thing that we're both pretty excited about the um, helicopter drop simulation. Okay. Which is. Um, a helicopter being dropped into a dam where we have to get out. Like, okay. save ourselves from drowning sort of thing. Okay, that sounds pretty cool. <laughs> and you're both excited about that? And there's also um, lots of other things, like we get to simulate our own mission, mm -hmm. like space launch. Mm -hmm. so when I was at Thomas Riddle, I'd sent a student over to space camp in Alabama, mm -hmm. and she actually has gone on to, I think, work at NASA, so oh, wow. it's, you know, it's a wonderful opportunity for them, so mm -hmm. yeah, we're pretty proud of that. Previous years have taken eight, nine, ten-year-olds. Okay. So, primary school? Yep. But we're some of the first actual high school kids. Okay. Because there's separate camps, one for juniors and one for older people. Okay. So we're the first ones going to the older camp. Mm -hmm. it's, it's a fairly expensive excursion, as mm. you can imagine, and so the only way that the region could get it up and running was to you know, ask a number of schools to go along. Mm. So we have two kids who wanted to go along, and yeah. it'll be a great experience for them. Yeah. It's fantastic. As a science teacher, we want to go to. Yeah. <laughs> Although Brett and Tyler are pioneering their way into the program, they still have to raise the money on their own. At the moment they're looking for sponsors, so if you can help get them there, please contact Campbelltown Performing Arts High School. Michelle Tavaniti reporting for the Campbelltown MacArthur Advertiser.